match crime to person. What the? For attempted murder, we're gonna call Johnny down. <laughs> what makes you think <laughs> I'm an attempted murderer? That I'm a failure in murdering. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Introduce yourself. My name's Shalee. I am a criminal defense attorney. I've been practicing for about 20 years. My name is Jaquay. I am 40 years young. Today you're gonna match crime. <laughs> oh, I get to stereotype people. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Do you have a criminal record? My teens and my 20s was really wild. All my charges are possession and <laughs> attempted to distribute charges, man, with narcotics. Three different charges, man. Have you ever committed a crime? Yes, it was a very easy vanilla crime. I used to smoke weed as a teenager. I've been convicted of two crimes. One was a cannabis offense when I was 21 years old. Another was I was accused of making a false statement and we settled it. I know what it's like to sit in the defense chair. Okay, I'm gonna hand you the list of the crimes. Mm. What kind of person comes to mind when you read out each one? Domestic violence, statistically males are much more um, likely to commit that kind of crime. Oh, attempted murder. It's usually something like this happens as crimes of passion. Felony drug possession. In my mind, I'm thinking of an older black guy. I grew up during the crack era, and so in my community, everyone was impacted by drugs. What I miss, Kenji, what I miss. Let's try to take a fucking yander bucko at the goddamn screen. We are a minute and 30 seconds into the goddamn video. What you think you missed? The fucking introduction, buddy. That's what you missed. The intro, you didn't miss nothing. We just started the video. The next identity theft, multiple counts. <laughs> You got to get close to people to get their information. You got to have a good gift of gab. You got to have a good game. My bias is okay. The next identity theft, multiple counts. <laughs> you got to get close to people to get their information. You got to have a good gift of gab. You got to have a good game. My bias is tells me younger women. You ready to meet the lion? Yes, I am ready. Are you nervous? Yes. He's like the painter guy. Oh, Bob Ross. Yeah, Bob I, Ross. I get that a lot. What's up with y'all, man? Okay. I'm gonna say the white bitch did attempted murder. No, she looked like she did drugs. I'm gonna say this bitch attempted murder. I'm gonna say uh, him car theft. Uh, him, uh, hold on, we gotta see the fucking things. Felony drug possession. Um, Felony drug everyone possession. Everyone loves drugs. People of all backgrounds, all types of people. And so um, I'm gonna say the girl, drug possession. Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna approach this, but we'll, we'll kind of see how this, how this goes. Ah. <sighs> Why don't you come on, come on over. I'm gonna pull you off for felony drug possession. You, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Why were you smiling when you walked out? I was, I was wondering, do I Why? fit the description? I, I, was, I was trying to figure it out. That's why it was funny to me. I grew up in the crack e epidemic when it was flooded the community. Back then, those oh. who um, were doing drugs, they looked like you. Oh. I got the clug look. They say felony drug possession, but he could have just been partying. Well, you look like you like to party, and so you might have had some, you know, after the club tonight, you know, you had some in your pocket, you know, you might have got a little too loud, somebody called the cops. What drugs do you think I had? Man, probably some ecstasy. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you look at me like that? What drugs have you done? Alcohol, weed, shrooms, acid, damn, molly, damn. mescaline, damn. peyote, damn. Fun ones so far. Uh, ayahuasca, yeah. heroin, damn, damn. Meth, now we're cocaine, to that, yeah. crack. Damn. I think you Damn! Oh my god! Fuck! I'm not one to judge. Fuck it. Pass it here. Come on, let's get high! I want some of that crack. You committed felony drug possession. Okay. It seems like something that like you really accepted about your past and that like is something that um you're not shy talking about. And, and you've done a lot of drugs, yeah. so yeah. Yes, I have. What makes me look like a part of here? Your aura is big. You look like you could go into a room and have some fun. That's your guess. Yes. What's next? Identity theft, multiple counts. Identity theft, I'm going to say, why is bro smiling? I want to say it's him. I want to say it's the guy to the right or the white guy. Like, why are they smiling so much, bro? Or maybe him in the middle. He's like a little finesser. I'm going to say it's the white boy with a smile. And if it's not, then it's him. Let me go here. I think that would be you. Why do you think I did identity theft? I think identity theft multiple counts would be for someone who is young and may not understand just the consequences i just am getting a feeling of some tech savviness being able to like 
Jerry rig. I mean, do you know like pro? Like, are you familiar with like programming or like hardware kind of stuff? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, I think that, I think it's you. <laughs> All right. You have to be able to get close to people. You know, saying you're not physically uh, threatening. You look like you might talk a little good game. Be able to get close to you know maybe some older naive people. Yeah. And you know, and get a hold of their things. She got an Apple Watch too. I'm standing on that. Reckless endangerment of a stolen vehicle. Ooh, that's the bitch right there. That's her or him. I'm not sure. Yeah. <laughs> come on over here, buddy. <laughs> Patrick, come on down. <laughs> Why do you think I have committed reckless endangerment? They all picked them. I'm either onto something or you've just been profiling this way too I much. think you're onto something. Okay. <laughs> you might have went to the meetup at night. You know what I'm saying? You know I'd have some fun. I mean, you hopped in somebody's car, man. You wanted to turn donuts at the car meetup. And, they, and your friend didn't like that. You might have hit something, man. They, wanted, they want the car to be paid for, but the mm. offer was like, you got to press charges. And this is what happened. But that's what I think. I don't know why you would steal a car, but you strike me as someone who could be driving high, um, which is reckless endangerment mm. and under the influence. Also, the earrings kind of, yeah, give. <laughs> the, it, wait, is this like a stolen car key? Or? Yeah, ex oh, so I didn't even notice there was a key, yeah. <laughs> I think we're sticking with the reckless endangerment stolen vehicle. Okay, thank you very much. Domestic violence, let me see. I'm going with a male. I'm gonna say it's the girl, bro. Far left. Who, sir? Damn. Far <laughs> left or middle? Middle or far left, bro? One of these two. Me look like the type of person that would be involved in domestic Funky. violence. All of the TV shows that I watch. Uh, Do I look like somebody that domestic violence? You look like you don't take you don't take no mess. See? Yeah, she agrees with me. <laughs> you look like a male. I look like a male. You okay. <laughs> <laughs> a man of color. When you see me as a person of color, is there a specific race that you might see? I do. Okay. I what see is that? you as a black male. Interesting. Am I right about my you're no. not a black male. You fit the picture you present as what they This see. feel mad racist. This feel hella racist. Yo, these videos are crazy. They just invite a bunch of strangers like, all right, profile them. <laughs> and like it's acceptable. It's acceptable because <laughs> it's a YouTube video. <laughs> In any other situation, bitch, you're going, you're getting dragged. Like, what the fuck? Show of pimps, hustlers. Oh, wow. On TV. Wow, that's literally what she said. Holy shit. I was joking. They, as in who? On um, the main media. So as a defense attorney, do you think that, like, the way you approach your clients might be through the lens of, like, what you might see in the media? Do you think that might be an issue? Okay, never mind. I don't, I don't want you for the domestic violence. Okay. I don't think you're the person. Right. I'm going to find someone else. Would you just- She's like, wait, I'm gonna get canceled on Twitter. Let me rethink my actions. Step back in line, please. Uh, what are you white bitches? Can you, please, one of the little white bitches, can you step up? <laughs> Describe yourself as emotionally grounded or like has waves. I sense a little like, you know, a fuse in you that could be, <laughs> that could be lit up. It depends on who the person is. Depends on who the per- yeah. Who the person is. That wasn't even part of the question. <laughs> cool. Yeah. I don't discriminate. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm just gonna- <laughs> I haven't called you yet. What? Oh, you come in so innocently. Okay. I don't know your sexual orientation. I'm gay. Okay. Have you ever been? She she says she's an attorney. Is that that's like a lawyer, right? Like people hire her to defend them in court. Yeah. Oh my f god. I yo, if I got that bitch as a lawyer, I'm going to prison. Like, dude, it's over. It's wrapped. I hope she got fired after this, bro. Not even fired. Like, bitch, she got so many people locked up just for me. I feel like she dumb. Honestly, I feel like a lot of lawyers. Not like a lot, but I feel like a lot of lawyers are just dumb as shit. Respectfully, like I feel like a lot of lawyers are just dumb as shit. They just went to school and went through the steps, bro. Like this bitch, don't, she does not seem bright and in an argument with your partner before yeah i'm gonna say that domestic violence is yours attempted murder and these are all somebody's charges in here yeah all right for attempted murder we're gonna call johnny down uh. <laughs> <laughs> what makes you think <laughs> i'm an attempted murderer that i'm a failure in murdering <laughs> Do you have like emotional, like violent tendencies? I'm cool as a cucumber, man. I'm, cool I'm the cucumber. smoothest guy here. You haven't noticed that? <laughs> oh yeah, now I'm actually second guessing myself. Now I'm feeling feeling into this. I don't think it's him. I've I mean, known I... some some uh, some murderers, attempted murderers, and like I'm gonna send you back because you seem like too friendly of a guy. Do you know murderers? <laughs> I, I do. I do. Yeah. <laughs> I do, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm excusing myself. Can you put the shiesty on for me real quick? I'm trying to get a visual. <laughs> This, he's the funniest fucking guy here, dude. And, you know, I'm just trying to, I'm trying to see. 
Yeah, you look kind of smooth criminal, Pimpin. Have you ever been betrayed by a partner before? Every last one of them. Have they cheated oh, wow. on you? Okay, maybe she got she got domestic and attempted bit. Were you angry? Yes. I'm giving you the conviction of attempted murder. Okay. You see how smooth it was? Yeah, yeah, there we go. I appreciate that. Attempted murder for sure. I'm gonna bring Shy <laughs> down. You seem like someone who could lash out, could have some some history of anger. Yeah, I've thrown tables into walls. So oh, what wow. sort of thing sets you off? Everything sets me off. I could have like a friend over and they'll breathe too loud. I'm telling you, domestic violence, bro. That or attempted. And I'll be like, can you shut up? Did you hit them? Like I've bitten chunks out of people like in Holy fights survival shit. of the fittest. I'm going to give you attempted murder. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's next on there? Theft in the second degree fraud. Okay, we're going to go with you. All right. You look put together. You look like you have expensive tastes. Why do you think I, I committed fraud? Yo, expensive taste is crazy. That motherfucker got, what, what are them called? Joga, joga pants, Janoga pants. What are jean yoga pants? What the fuck are them called? Jogas, Jayoga. Like he probably got ass. Wait till he turn around. Jeggings, jeggings. Thank you. Leggings and jeans, jeggings. I said yoga. Oh my fucking God. I sound like a Hispanic mother. Where the joke up is? I don't know. Like, bitch, what the fuck am I talking about? I'm sorry. Uh, jeggings. What the fuck is going on? I think I, I committed fraud. Did you steal some of your stuff back? You know what I'm saying, girlfriend? You know what I'm saying? You broke to your old girlfriend's house? Why would it be trumped up to like a fraud charge if I was just stealing my stuff? Cause you probably, cause you probably grabbed some of her stuff that was in there, man. And she was like, oh, he took, he used my ATM card to buy a bottle that's of not, liquor or something. That's not fraudulent though. Yeah, man. That's what they call it. You ever, you see all the charges under fraud when they charge people for that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's all kind of ways that they can get you and stick you in the slammer, man. Have you ever embellished the truth in order to like get a job? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. yeah. Theft in the second degree fraud. Okay. Possess he just teleported back there, motherfucker. You hiding all that ass back there. What you hiding for back there? Possession of a stolen firearm, grand theft auto, burglary, and car prowling. Come on up here, brother. Come on up here, brother. Man, and see, I hate to do this to a black man, but I'm trying to think through it because I'm, charges is always trumped up. Have you ever fired a gun before? Allegedly. Oh. Have you ever been inside of a stolen vehicle before? Yeah, I've definitely been inside of a stolen vehicle before. Have you ever fired a gun? There's been a lot of places I've fired I a gun. I feel like, bro, I feel like he's the one that did the car thing now. What the fuck? Why he say it like that? Cool. So there's a chance that you had a gun that did not have your name on it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You bought a pistol off the home you didn't know it was hot. Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> Mine are saying it's not just stealing one car, it's like being a part of a system. There's like an element of trust involved. Like the mob. <laughs> like the mob, exactly. I think that's I think that's it. I'm going with you for possession of stolen firearm, Grand Theft Auto, burglary, and car prowl. All right. I hate to do this to you, brother, but that's where I'm at. I mean, they're all crimes. Man. And I'm a brother. <laughs> so so, <laughs> so it's not like we can avoid the inevitable I in this know, scenario. So, I mean, it's, just, it's just matching the dots. You I can't wait to so see it. where they match at. <laughs> Show of hands, who did Jacob guess correctly? No Damn. one. Damn. No <laughs> one. I, look, I didn't hear nobody more. I was like, yeah, you, you blew that, buddy. One. What? Not even two. Not even two. Okay. They're going to come out and talk to you one at a time. You guessed attempted murder, but no, I had theft in the second degree oh. and fraud. I had a personal check, and I didn't know that um, on the back of it, it's faint with the person's real information on it. It's like a new security feature. I tried to cash it, and they arrested me. Damn. Okay. Yeah, how did you get your hands on these things? There's a whole bunch of websites that you can go to, and I can get any of your guys' social security numbers, birthdays, and... Holy shit. And steal any of your guys' information right now. Oh, she need to work for the CIA, boy. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That's fucked up. That's true, actually. Why is that in, Why is that even in place? Why does the government even allow that? Like, what? Why, why aren't we... Isn't that like a big... You know, in, instead of maybe like just catching them when they do the crime, maybe we could just prevent the crime altogether, maybe lock that shit down. You know what I mean? That sounds a little smarter, no? Okay. I'm just a streamer. I don't know what I'm talking about. So the government give you a job. They are two different charges. Um, The theft in the second degree. I... <clears throat> Rob Burger King, my old job. What'd you steal from Burger King? $5,000.
Five thousand dollars. Yeah. Is that just just money, no food? No food. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, while you're in there, you know. No food. Um, well, because I was the assistant manager there. Man, they really trusted you. It was because my um, I busted my ass there every single day, working from open to close, not Damn. seeing my kids, and my manager just kept lying to me and kept lying to me. I just. Bitch is Burger King. What you thought? You thought he was gonna get a fucking promotion, raise, manager? Fuck out of here. Had enough and emptied out the whole safe. Damn. Yeah. All right, who's next? Damn, I've messed everybody up, bro. I have a drug possession charge from okay. when I was 18. Worked with uh, somebody who was like family to me. Mm -hmm. Ended up getting pulled over by like 15, 16 cops in the crime scene investigation. Damn. Man, and I ended up taking the rap for everything, so. Damn. What was it? What was it? Crack. Crack? Yeah. Yep. I didn't finish this charge until I was 25 years old. Damn. Wow. So just you spent some time. Yeah. Why it take so long? Yeah. Just because I kept running on probation. Oh, gotcha. I would make you can't it be like, doing that, yeah, dude. <laughs> I would make it like a year, almost a year on probation. And then I had my first son around the time I was 23. When he was born, I was on the run still. It took a lot to be like, I want to finish this part of my life and yeah. move forward. It's so. a big hump. Well, yeah. good for you, man. Yeah. That's Appreciate awesome. Appreciate it, man. Thank oh, yeah. you. I had you for the possession of Gerard, but that's not it. It was attempted murder. Oh, it was attempted it was a murder. Scenario where an individual uh, was supposed to fight my cousin at a gas station. Mm. He didn't like how it was turning out, I guess, and the individual decided that he wanted to go get a shotgun and started firing the shotgun. At the, at the gas station. At the gas station. And then so I acted by the only way that I knew how, and I fired and shot him. When I went for a trial, they ruled that I was wrong for defending myself and defending him, even though he let off two different times. Then I got hit with the spread from some of the gauge and, the, and when he was Damn. falling down getting shot. I got the wrong to the stick, you know, I did 13 and a half years because of it. I sat down, you know, went in front of a judge and he declared that my sentence was too long, knocked 40 months off. I'm supposed to still be in the joint right now. I'm not generally a violent person. Sure. It's just, I believe that, you know, in certain times you protect yourself or you protect your family. If you're in those Isn't scenarios, that fuck, bro? The justice system's fuck? That's some bullshit. That's, bro look like a dad. I mean, he's old, like y'all are stupid. <laughs> people would act differently. I mean, that's what people should have firearms for is to protect themselves, not to go and be the aggressor. And hurt exactly. The and I've only been home for five months. Wow, well, welcome home. <laughs> are you a public defender, by the way? I started off my career in public defense. It's kind of rough because it's like some of the things you were saying is like, like, as I see on TV, you're a defense attorney. So it's supposed to be how you interpret the law mm. and how you interpret others to be fair or non-partial when it bro a convicted motherfucker what, what was he convicted for attempted murder is speaking facts to a bitch that went to school dude this bitch sound dumb you interpret the law and how you interpret others to be fair or non-partial when it comes to certain things to defend them uh, mine is domestic violence yeah what what happened what didn't happen <laughs> that night i went to jail it was me against my uh ex-fiance things started Damn. picking up he's like on drugs everything just came out and i just like started he's he's like fuck you bitch fuck you bitch you can't suck my dick right fuck you bitch fuck you you ain't shit you ain't shit. get away from me i hit you bitch fuck you talking about bit what oh you would fuck becky your gay ass wouldn't fuck becky fuck you you're gonna fuck me tonight fuck you bitch suck this zit. like bro i'm sorry Oh, Kenji, my fault, my fault. I'm just trying to play it out in my head. This is what's going on. My, Kenji, my fault. Okay, my fault. Bitch! Okay, sorry. Lost your balloon popped. Yeah, and so they took his word off of everything, but uh, he doesn't want to further the charges because... um. This is still active? Yeah. Don't say anything else on this. Okay, I'm going to have him go back. Stop talking about it. <laughs> you said I uh, attempted murder. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> well, then I got Because that's in the drugs. Oh. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> I did the reckless endangerment in stolen vehicle. Oh, when shit. I was 14, my mom gave me a stolen car and I went on a joyride. Did you know it was stolen? Yes. Okay. She told me not to get caught. Gotcha. I crashed the car and got You don't admit that. Got caught. And I didn't want my baby sister to go in foster care and my mom to go to prison, so I took the slap on the wrist when I was 14. Damn. Wow. You are the third person <laughs> to choose me today for reckless endangerment. Well, I actually had the car prowl, stolen firearm, Grand okay. Theft Auto, burglary. Holy gotcha. shit. I was a whole different person. I was living on the streets, okay. kind of got tired of it. So, broke into someone's house, burglary charge, took their keys from the front door, Grand Theft Auto, had the car for a few days, got arrested in a McDonald's drive through on Easter Sunday. Damn. <laughs> you want that egg with muffin for breakfast, huh? I was hungry. I get it. I get it, man. And then they catch me with the, the gun. Was it your gun? Oh, no, it was stolen. How has that impact? 
Bro, what is going on, dude? Impact is you now. Well, the impact was just basically getting jobs up until the point where I did get a job, but everything's been pretty solid ever since then. So you said it was a different life. Did that change things for you, that experience, or? Oh, definitely. Uh, friend groups, there's a lot of people I left behind, like a lot of people that I used to uh, use with. Um, I'm seven years clean in Congratulations. September. All right, man. He said it, y'all had some fun. See, I said it was like a fun night. He need to go steal some goddamn Jordans, bro. I don't know what the fuck. He had fake 13s he on his feet. With, um, he need to go do that shit again. In Congratulations. September. All right. Bro, I'll be, I'll be ashamed. Bro, got fresh, what are these, fours? Threes? I don't know. These fours? Bro, got threes, bro. Some brand new Jordans on next to them fucking fake 13s. Holy shit. Kenji, nah, fuck that. Is that a logo on there? Or is that something on my screen? Bitch. No, that's the logo. That little ass jump man on the side. What the fuck? He jumping over the goddamn, he couldn't even be centered? My fault. Yo, Joy, thank you for the prize. See, I said it was like a fun night. I kinda had it. It was a fun few days. Yeah, yeah, right, cool. <laughs> I had you. I, I had so, you a couple of times. Yeah, so you originally thought domestic violence. Yep. Yes, which was incorrect. And then be. I thought that you were a black male. Yes, which is incorrect. Right. Uh, I'm actually South Asian. Okay, uh, what was your conviction? Multiple counts of identity theft. Uh, mm. uh, how much money did you get? Close to a million, probably. Damn! What? I went from zero to 26 felonies in one fell swoop. So it was 25 Holy. counts of identity theft and then possession of a controlled substance. Holy a controlled shit. Substance. Uh, heroin and meth. Oh, you was high on this shit, huh? Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah for <laughs> sure. Yeah. Hey, man, okay. Basically, my ex and I, right at the height of, like, I had a career in television and media, got hooked on Oxy. Oxy led to heroin and led to smoking heroin and meth, um, mm -hmm. and then ended up basically losing everything. We learned Holy how to print shit. IDs, uh, get profiles of people, use their lines of credit, and just took off for about a year and a half. And then me, my ex, and then a friend of ours were caught? arrested on March 28th, 2013. Okay. But March 29th, 2013 is my clean and sober date. And okay. I just recently celebrated 10 years of being Hey, man, congratulations, sober. man. You. Good um, stuff. So, you know, success builds on success. And I took that energy with me when I got out five years ago and just ran with it. Cool. Well, cool. thank you very much. Thank you. Bro, that is great. Duo almost made a mill. Chat, do we have any, like, what if the big gifters, like Lady Lynn or Chifuyaki, what if they're, like, out here doing illegal shit? Not out here doing illegal shit, chat? Is anyone out here doing illegal shit? That is crazy. How was this experience? Good. It's. Oh, it's eye opening, good to bitch. Know the story. When you walk into a room, how do people see you? And then how do you make certain that you take up space to defy all of those stereotypes? You learn a lot through this process. I think there's a lot of reasons that people commit crimes. That bitch so said a whole lot of nothing. Judge someone based off of, you know, everyone's got their own story and that's just maybe a part of and a piece of what makes someone who they are at any given point. Dude, move.